Hi everyone, it's Kirchi. For this Polly Pocket Showcase, I'm going to be showing the Jewel Collection. It's a set of four compacts that look very fancy, and you guessed it, they have jewels on them, hence the name Jewel Collection. The little dolls also have jewels, and inside the compact are more jewels. Jewels, jewels, jewels. So many jewels. These also come with a couple necklaces that also have jewels. So let's take a look at the jewel collection. This is the Polly Pocket Jewel Collection. As you can see, there are several different designs here. We have the gold ones over here, the silver ones here, and we also have two pendants. This is called the Jewel Collection by the very obvious jewels that are right in the middle of these compacts and inside we also have more jewels and we even have jewels on the characters which we're going to see in just a minute the jewel collection also comes with some rings that follow the same theme so here is one that i have called sky princess this one also comes in pink right now i only have the blue one of the jeweled rings and i'm definitely hoping to get more because they are so adorable we are going to start with this one. I always start with the pink one traditionally. This is called Jeweled Palace. All of these compacts have been repainted and restored by me. So I gave this one a fresh coat of metallic paint. Same with the other ones. I also restored the logo with my sticker method. And I sell this sticker now on my merch store on my blog site. And the link is in the description. So Check that out if you want to buy one of these stickers to restore your Polly Pockets. The exterior is super beautiful. I love the design. On the back, of course, we have the Bluebird logo and the year, which is 1992. I think the design looks really classy. I love the raised textures over here. The gem itself is just plastic. I believe it's acrylic but it looks really shiny and beautiful and I gave it a coat of glossy varnish just to make it shine a little bit more. This one has definitely been used. We can see a lot of scratches inside and I haven't restored the inside yet because I mainly focus on the exterior, but that is something that I'm definitely going to have to do. This is giving me Aladdin Princess Jasmine vibes. I love the color scheme. I think the gold and pink go really well together. First, we have this gold door over here with a heart on it that opens up. I think that's really cute and super, super small. I'm trying to get my nails to open it. There you go. We have big fluffy pillows over here. There's some cosmetic items over here, maybe some makeup, perfume. There's a teeny tiny bath over here. And we have a treasure chest with a ruby inside. This treasure chest comes out so you can just pull it out, hold it in your hand, admire the beautiful gem, and just pop it back in. Going up the stairs, we get to the second level. We see a beautiful throne and gorgeous scenery outside these windows. Lots of beautiful decorations all around, and it just looks like a really rich kingdom. On the highest level, we see a beautiful princess bed. I've always wanted a bed like this with a little canopy on top. I just think it looks really cozy and gorgeous. Here is Polly looking like a beautiful ruby princess. She's got a ruby gem on her head. She has a beautiful headscarf, and her outfit looks like Princess Jasmine's outfit, but in pink. She also has a monkey friend, and this little guy's name is Chatter. This next one is called Jeweled Iceland. I absolutely love how this one looks. I actually posted a picture of this on my Instagram with my matching lavender nails at the time and it just looked really, really beautiful. And I was inspired to take that photo because I just love the color scheme of this and how the silver looks against the lavender. This one has a white frosty gem and a silver logo, which we don't see often in vintage Polly Pockets, but they do exist. There are a few out there. This is one of them. And just like the gold sticker logo, I also sell a silver version on my merch store. This is a beautiful winter wonderland. I love how this looks. The colors are very soft and pastel, which is right up my alley. I love aesthetics like this. On the bottom, we have this little gate, which looks like icicles. Let's open this up. There we go. There is a sled over here, which looks like it has 
gone from here all the way down to the bottom. It doesn't move though, but the indication is there. We have a pair of ice skates over here, super cute. I love those decorations in the back, the little stripes. They just look so unique. There is also this cute little seal right by what appears to be a birthday cake. It looks like a cake, but maybe I just have cake on my mind right now. But inside is a beautiful jewel. It's that same white frosted jewel that's on the front of this compact. It actually looks like real ice. Just like with the other one, you can also remove this and put it right back. On the second level, we see another throne, an ice throne. I love those little ice crystals that are coming out of the throne. There's also a little cave over here. We have a beautiful winter bedroom up here. Hopefully she has a heater because it looks freezing in there. And through the windows over here, we can see some snowy mountains. I love the sides over here because it looks like this entire room is inside a giant glacier. It kind of reminds me of the Ice Kingdom in Adventure Time. Here is Ice Queen Polly. She has her super fluffy outfit on to keep her warm and that same clear jewel on her crown. And this is Snowy, her polar bear friend. How cute. This next one is called Jeweled Forest. This one has an emerald green gem right in the middle, and we are back to the gold logo and gold embellishments. This one is so cute and looks like a beautiful fantasy forest filled with magical creatures. We have a tiny little white gate over here and it takes us all the way into this enchanted forest filled with mushrooms and flowers. We have two little mushrooms over here and this big one has the emerald gem. Just like the other ones, this one comes out and you can just pop it back in. There's a table right here with some drinks so the forest creatures can have a little gathering. There's a beautiful river with this bridge right in the middle. There's lily pads, flowers, and more plants all around here. I love these steps that are made of tree stumps. They take you to the second level. This is a big beautiful tree house. I love how this looks. We even see a little swing over here. We have some critters over here, a bunny and a birdie. There is a cozy dining room here and a ladder that takes you to just a simple hammock bed. This definitely reminds me of the Berenstein Bears and also Little Bear, who remembers that show that was one of my favorite shows as a kid. I love the theme music in that show. Here is our forest princess, Polly. She has the most beautiful and creative dress made of leaves, and of course the emerald gem on her crown. And this is her squirrel companion, Scamper. He looks like he's made of chocolate. I'm just always thinking about food. The last one of these round compacts is called jeweled sea. It has a blue sapphire gem right in the middle, and as the name suggests, this is an underwater themed compact. Underwater themes are always so gorgeous and never disappoint. We have a seashell door over here. I love this one so much. A treasure chest with some gold booty in there. We might also be in a shipwreck because we can see part of the ship over here that's broken on top and we have an anchor and a wheel just floating around. There's also a tiny cave in there and this giant seashell which has the blue sapphire gem. And yes, you can remove this one as well. There's more sea creatures in there. On the second level, this is indeed a ship. There is a seashell thrown over here and just a simple hammock. This looks to be another bag of treasure and we have more sea creatures just hanging on to the ship. This is our ocean goddess, Polly, and unfortunately she's not a mermaid, but she is wearing a beautiful teal dress with these seashell straps, or maybe seashell bra. It's kind of hard to tell her anatomy, but she looks really gorgeous. And of course, she has the sapphire gem on her crown. This is Diver, which is either an otter or a beaver. I think that there was some debate on OnlyPollyPocket.com, which is the site that I reference to get to know all the animal friends and all the characters. 
So what do you guys think? Is it an otter or a beaver? Now we are moving on to the pendant. So this pink one is called Pretty Present Locket. It is definitely pretty. I am loving the color scheme. This shade of pink is actually my favorite color ever. This is actually the only one of the series to have a heart shape because the other ones are circle. This is the original chain that it came with. I've never liked this. I think it feels really cheap and gets dirty very easily like you see here. So I replaced it with this beautiful silver chain and it looks so much prettier when I wear it and I actually do wear this from time to time. And it looks like a real fashion accessory rather than a toy. It is so dainty inside. I love it so much. I just really love pastel aesthetics. On the bottom, we have this big, beautiful couch with heart patterns, and there are presents everywhere. We have these little ones here, and this big one. This big one has the beautiful pink gem. For some reason, this gem looks a lot more sparkly than the other ones. I'm not sure if this is made of plastic or actual rhinestone, but... This definitely looks a lot more high quality. On the second level, we get to have some cake. There are also balloons up here and a place to put your photo. I haven't put a photo in there yet because I don't know what I wanna put. I don't wanna put my face. Maybe I can do a picture of Polly. Speaking of Polly, here she is and she looks so gorgeous with her pink dress and that gem in her crown. She is also a pretty good size, so even though this is a tiny locket, this is one of the bigger sized Polly's. And the second pendant is called Dress Up Jewel. This one has a sky blue gem and it is so mesmerizing. I also replaced the cord on this one, so I went with a gold chain to match these gold embellishments. This is a fashion-themed compact. We see a bunch of clothes all around here, shoes, accessories. She's trying on a bunch of things, trying to figure out what she wants to wear for the day. In this treasure chest, we see that same sky blue gem. And again, this one looks to be a higher quality than the one on the front. On the second level, we see another place to put our photo. And again, it's blank. I don't quite know what to put there yet. There's a fancy dress over here more accessories, more shoes. She really needs to organize her closet because as someone who is very organized and a neat freak, I'm just having a little bit of anxiety here. This is our fashionista Polly and she is wearing what appears to be a 1920s flapper girl outfit and that same gem is also on her headgear. I'm wearing this one right now. Look how cute it looks. These are so gorgeous and I love them even more because they look like Sailor Moon compacts. Or the crystals from Jewel Riders. Who remembers that show? Did I dream that show? Thank you for watching the super sparkly Polly Pocket Showcase and I'll see you on the next one.